Okay, I want to talk about validation for mixed faith marriages. Validation is super important, especially when there's tender feelings and tender emotions. Now, I know from my work with clients and from my own lived experience that a Mormon mixed faith marriage is abundant in tender feelings and sensitive, like sensitivities. And so validation can be an important tool we learn and develop and use in our mixed faith marriage. So I want to give you some warnings as you consider using validation more in your mixed faith marriage. There are validation is given and validation is received. And those are two very different things. And I'm just going to look at validation being received here. So if I hear, I'm, I'm sorry, that's terrible. After I've told somebody about an experience, about a hurt, about a frustration I have, and the validation I get is that's terrible. Then I think, oh, they really care. They're really listening. They're on my team and I feel supported. I feel loved. I have received the validation. If I hear, I'm sorry you feel that way, then I think, do they not agree with me? Like, do they think my feelings are wrong? Do they think I'm like not right here? And, and I feel judged and validation is not received. Like that validation was anti-validation. Like it probably isn't going to help the relationship at all. And it's interesting to me because like I was saying earlier, there's a lot of tender emotions and a lot of like validation would be such good balm for so many people in a mixed faith marriage. And I think it's worth our time and energy to sort of do a validation audit. You know, what, how am I validating? And, and ask your spouse, like, what is, what can I do to make it easier for you to receive validation. Now there are no guarantees here. You can't ever force them to receive your validation or, you know, always have the stars align, but it's worth a conversation. I like to consider what makes it easy for me to receive validation and then learn from that and ask them like, what makes it easy for you to receive validation and learn from that and apply it and run with it. So for me, a lot of times the simple ones are the easiest, like that's terrible. Okay. I like it so easy for me to receive that. So consider in your mixed faith marriage, do you want to increase validation? Like have a conversation, ask them, you know, when have you really felt validated by me? And then look at like what you said and learn from that. And when have you not felt validated from me and look at what you said and learn from that. And this isn't to, you know, guarantee that they're always going to feel validated, but this is to make sure you're like doing your best as a partner and trying to improve and show up. It's a really powerful way to show love. All right. This is Brooke Booth, Mormon, mixed faith marriage, life coach.